Hello there everyone, Quinnigidi here, welcome back to another video. Today I am here reacting to The Sims 4 Generation Family in Australia, whatever, because I think it would be fun to just look at these kind of opinions and such on how Generations would have come into the game. Now, in my opinion, Generations is a missed opportunity, um, like something that they could have further expanded on for Parenthood. I always say that Parenthood should have been something bigger. Um, but yes, but before we get to this, I would just like to explain as to where I've been and what's happening So I haven't uploaded in about six days and that is because I was in my school musical. It is over now I'm very depressed my whole the whole cast is depressed because it's just so sad that it's it's over We did it. We did amazing. We sold out two incredible nights and it's over now though so I can put more time into doing YouTube I don't have to come home at 10 o'clock and then do homework and then go to sleep. I can come home with my homework finished and focus on other things in life at the moment. So I'm very excited that I get to do YouTube again. So that is that is a thing. So we are here and let us do it right now. Okay, let me turn on my speaker. Okay, I have no clue. I did not watch this. Yep, this is not a, okay. Okay. So we're starting off with toddlers in what looked like a sand pit, which is cute. Definitely, I would love to see more toys if they were to have. So le let's imagine that Parenthood is in the game, but like they were going to make it something bigger. Definitely more toys were necessary. I think everything that should have been in toddler stuff should have been in Parenthood. So it looks like there's definitely more relationships building a few, la few years later. Okay, look at this. So, I think that, like, teenagers should have more things to do in the game because, personally, they're just, like, beans at home. Like, they don't really do anything. Um, also, if Generations were to come in, I think that they would add, like, a little middle stage. Like, I think that there should be things in The Sims called, like, mid-stages. Um, like, they have a lot of life stages, but I think they should have mid-stages. So, I think there should be a mid-stage. Like, I think they should have child, and then they should have preteen, and then teen. So, Preteen would be a mid stage where they like kind of grow up, grow up, but like it wouldn't be that much of a change. And then I also think that they should have a change between adult and elder, like just like a, or either that or like elder and then like a freaking senior, like on their deathbed. Like I think that they should have something like that. So I think those are like mid stages. So it looks like it looks like there's just you know growing a family, which is very nice. I also think it would be cool, you know, just a lot more interactions with your kids because, as I said, in Parenthood, like, this is a thing, an ongoing theme with a lot of Sims expansion packs. When you get it and you play it, like, for the first five episodes of a Let's Play, it's so much fun. But then after it, this gets boring because even with cats and dogs, like, you'd think cats and dogs, the possibilities are endless, but there's literally, like, four interactions that you can do with your dog. It's so depressing doing the same thing over and over again. Also, I apologize for this sunburn. I was outside all day. Alright. So it just once again just looks like a lot of family interactions. Looks like there's a lot of clubbing involved and just love and definitely I would like a, a memory making system if this were to be a thing as well. It seems like, you know, parenthood, it seems like it would be a very generic pack. So this one she is dying sadly. Right. Okay, so overall, a pretty simple trailer, nothing so special. Um, if they were to make something with, like, Parenthood, I would really, as I said, like, assume it would be very close to what, um, if they were going to make something like Generations, I would assume it would be really close to what Parenthood was already like, because... I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like it. It's a big help. Let me know what you guys think about this. If you think this is actually necessary or if you think Parenthood kind of just did it for us. I'm going to try to upload every day this week, but I don't I don't upload on Thursdays. I, I never upload on Thursdays or anymore because Wednesdays are Wednesday nights are packed for me, so I can't record the video for Thursday. And I usually try not I don't know. But I'm gonna really stick to it. I, I mean I always stick to it. It's just that for once in my life, I actually did something, and I enjoyed it, and I loved it, so I took 
you know, a little break. Not because I wanted to, but because literally I had no other time to do YouTube. So that was that. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I am back. I'm going to be live streaming much more often. That is another thing that I really stopped for a long time. Not even for these past six days. I just, like, stopped live streaming because I had absolutely no time. So I'm going to start doing those again. I'm going to finally start up my podcast. It's going to be so good. Um, so, yes. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like it. It's a big help. And I will see you guys all again next time. Goodbye. Woo.